It is Pet of the Week time. Jerry Lee is in the house along with Char Carey. Char, thanks for being here with us. What can you tell us about Jerry Lee? Well, this little sweetheart uh, was found in Booming Prairie at the end of October, just a little stray out on his own. Okay. And uh, so these kind people rescued him and brought him to the shelter. He had a, a little, de he has a little defect in his right eye. Okay. And it's, it may be from an old injury sure. or just a, a corneal lesion or something that didn't get any medical attention, but it, it does not seem to have affected his vision at yeah, all. Yeah, it so seems he's, that he's yeah. looking around just so fine. So he's just a little sweetheart. He loves to be held. He purrs a lot. He's kind of an active little kitty, and we love his name. I'm not quite sure who gave that to him. But. <laughs> well, we mentioned Jerry Lee Lewis passed away in October of this <laughs> year, could so be. Could, could be. be the namesake. And, you know, this guy is very talented, and he's very active, but he does not play the piano. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> so, he's been neutered, and uh, he's had uh, his vaccinations, and so he's all ready to go. He's very social. There's a, another little kitty that, because we're fairly crowded, yeah. he share, is sharing his crate with another kitty. They get along just oh. great. So we know he gets along well with other cats. And okay. He was real calm in the car when I brought him here, but kind of scared in the crate. So yeah. it's, you know, he's not had a lot of experience, obviously. Yeah, I don't blame him being a little frightened through. in the crate. I know. <laughs> Where are you taking me? But yeah. He's just a little sweetie, and he's awfully cute. He's got nice markings. He's, he's what we call a tabby and white. Nice little stripey tail, so mm -hmm. he's just looking for a good home. You're looking for a nice family, and hopefully he'll go to somewhere where there's either another cat sure. or they might adopt another kitten. Yeah, It'd maybe nice they... if his little right, his little playmate, his little crate mate could yes. go with him. So. Yes. So you but. mentioned you have a lot of kitties right now. We do. We have a lot of them, and it just you know it's the I don't know if it's a phenomenon from the pandemic or, sure. or what but you know every shelter is kind of reporting the same thing and you know with the downturn in the economy I'm sure adoptions are down a mm -hmm. bit and so it's it's a real um, balance that we have to strike yeah. but you know we keep them till they find good homes and you know being homeless is not a, a capital crime so right. we don't want to put anybody down just because they don't have a home so right we'll find one for him but he's such a good boy and he's so sweet I think he'll do just fine yeah very very pretty we pulled up his picture before he showed up and everyone <laughs> in the newsroom oh oh I want to yeah. adopt and so if you're willing at home and if you have the resources to adopt a new little kitty Jerry Lee might be for you and maybe if you'd like two cats he has a good friend that could Maybe. also use a forever home. Uh, for folks at home who maybe want to adopt Jerry Lee or another pet from Paws and Claws, how do they do so? Just uh, check the website and there's a form to fill out. We do some pre-screening and things like that and then call the shelter and make an appointment to come in and meet this kitty or some of the other kitties and we try to make a good match so that would be our goal here, a match for the person and for the for the kitties. And yeah. We're always so grateful to the community and the people willing to adopt these animals because right. if we didn't have that cadre of people, we couldn't exist. So yeah, well, Thanksgiving's Char, a good time. To yes, say thank it you is. To and maybe think about us. it over the holiday. Can I adopt a pet? And if you can, and you're willing, Jerry Lee could use a forever we home. Thanks for being here. Ticket. Thank you. We always appreciate it. We'll see you're you next welcome. week. You're welcome. All right, more to come on Midwest Access, including Julian Mitchell joining us with his Movie Minute segment next.